We do run cattle, but really I think that we raise grass. The important part is that how we harvest that grass. We try not to, we kind of do the holistic grazing way in a, in a larger manner and in two or three or 10, 20,000 acre pastures instead. We try not to graze, the, especially during the growing season, the same pasture every year. Our cow, uh, we call our factory. She owes us a living. So those cattle have to do well on our grass. But when they leave and go to Kansas is where these cattle are at, they explode when they hit really quality feed like that. And I think to get that, you have to maintain the factory, which is the cow. We are really up on one, genetics, uh, to the health, we worm our cattle twice a year. Vaccination program is very critical. How we give the vaccination is even more critical. We raise all our own bulls and we run Solera Angus cattle. We run a composite herd. We're not really interested in what percent of Angus or what percent Solera they are. We're interested in what type phenotypically the cow that we want. We raise a few excess bulls and we sell a few of those and the main reason is it gives us a choice or a chance to select what we want. And also, it also lets us uh, go out and purchase a better herd bull. So we'll breed the cows for 60 days, the heifers for 42 days, and after we pull the bulls out of the cows, we will sex our calves. We'll, the steer pairs will go one way, the heifer pairs will go another way. We know we're going to sell every steer pair. So they kind of take the lead to get to the higher country, our better grass. As far as I know, we're going to sell, keep, continue selling by the pound. So we want to get as many pounds as we can. Uniformity is a very important tool. I take a lot of pride in the uniformity of, of our cow herd, of our bull battery, of our selection of bulls. And, and the consistency of our cattle in the feedlot has, has proven that. I tell my guys, I said, every day you have your red book with you and you have your pocket knife and the pencil because that's important and we can be stopped on the creek or up on a hill and we do our homework. My daughter, she has an iPhone or something and so she punches it in her iPhone. We're really, really particular about what we know about our cattle. When we move from one pasture to the other, we count every time.